ואסור לחודש הזה, ויקחו לכם איש שא. וזה מצווה אוף ביקור קורבן פסח, four days before the שחיטה. י' ניסון. הבא פסח שני. פסח שני is י"ד אייר. Is there a mitzvah on י' אייר to be מבקר the קורבן פסח or not? כמו שזה מסכת עם פסוחים, דף צדיק ו' עומד א', ואסור לחודש הזה. That's Nisan. But the word is always in the Hodesh. This word is only for Nisan, not for Iyar, not for Pesach Sheni. Rashi says, there's no mitzvah, Bikr, Korban, Pesach Sheni. Pesach Mitzrayim is a mitzvah to buy it on Yud Nisan. But the door is, you don't have to buy it on Yud Nisan, you can buy it before. You can. But you have to have at least four days of Bikr, and you have to check the Korban, just like checking the Romain letters for Bogs. that we're going to use the night of Pesach, we have to check the Korban Pesach. There should be no blemishes four days before Pesach. It is questionable whether you have to check it every single day, but it's a mitzvah to check the Korban Pesach four days before Pesach. From Yud Nisan on, Pesach Sheni, the Gemara says in Psochim, there's no chiv to check the Korban four days before Pesach Sheni. In Yud Iyar, you don't have to check the Korban Pesach. It's enough a day before. The Chesam Sofer in one of the Tshuvas mentions that this is Yud Iyar, The day of Bikur Pesach Sheni. This tshuva is Yerdea Reish Lamed Gimel, and it's a plea. Chesam Sofer calls Yud Iyar the Yom Bedikas Pesach Sheni. It seems that it clashes with the Gemorian Mesechte Psochim. The Galanterov in Sefer Or Pnei Yehoshua wants to answer this Chesam Sofer with a kushia, a question that is Sar Sholom Bebelz, the first Belzeruv, asks in the Haggadah Shel Pesach. When we eat Korech, מעט ונמורל, הוא עושה זכר למקדוש כהילל, לקיימה שנאמר, על מצויס ומרוירים יאכלוהו. This is פוסוק, it's in פסח שני, פרשס בהא לא יזכו. In our פרשס says, ומצויס על מרוירים יאכלוהו, פרשס בו. Why is it that בעל ההגודה של פסח switches the פסוקים, instead of saying the פוסוק of פסח ראשון, says the פוסוק of פסח שני. אבשיה לבלזר, his son, answers his father's question that the Agodesh of Pesach over here, the Kaim HaShenemar is a filo, a levai that we should be mekayim, a chilas korban Pesach, at least Pesach Sheni. It's a bakosho and a tfilo, the Kaim HaShenemar. Let's be mekayim what says in Pesach Sheni. Al matzo zimroim yochlu, we should eat Pesach Sheni on Tez Vov Iyor. The emes de Rashbam and Psochim is goyles the posuk of Pesach Rishon. The Kaim HaShenemar u matzo is al miroirim יאכלוהו. פסוחים ק"ט ו' עמוד א'. צבי לצדיק בינס דאון, דאי זה השולמי יוססי לגדר אשבם. ומצוס על מרואים יאכלוהו. נא לגבי הבן אבו הגודל של פסח. תוהר שלמה אוסו בינס דאון, הגודל של פסח אוף פראק ונציה אוסו הבדה גירסה אוף דה פוסק אוף פרשס בו. נא לגבי הבן אבו הגודל של פסח תודה. אבל רב שיר לבזר רוצה לומר את זה נראה תוהר סופר, ואני אומר, זה לא שם תפילו. דשולו מישיב Rabbi Yosef Shulom HaLevi Notenzon, when he heard this pshat from Rabbi Shiel Belzer, he was a little upset. He says this is against HaMefele SheGemore Mesechte Psochim. The Gemore in Dav Ayn Tesumet Alef, Ein Tzibur Nitcho LePesach Sheni. So how can you say that the God of Pesach is Betoyras Tzefilo, that we should be mekain LePesach Sheni, the whole Tzibur on here, since Mashiach did not come Pesach Rishon, it's a Gemorim Mefureshes that there isn't such a thing as a Tzibur should be Nidche to Pesach Sheni. When they told the Rav to Rav Shiel Belzer, he answered that the Shoilu Meishif forgot a Yerushalmi that is much more over there, that the Mashiach is going to come between the two Psochim, the whole Tzibur can eat from Pesach Sheni, and that's not considered Nidche to Pesach Sheni. If the Tzibur is Tome in Pesach Rishon, and there is a Pesach Migdosh, then you say, Tumo Hutra Betzibur, and the whole Tzibur makes the Korban Pesach Rishon Betumo. And you don't say that Tzibur should be Nidche to Pesach Sheni. That's if you have a Beis HaMikdosh. But if you don't have a Beis HaMikdosh and Pesach Rishon, then definitely, when Mashiach comes between the two Psochim, we would be Mekayim, a Krovos Pesach on Pesach Sheni. That's our case. So the Or Pene Yeshua wants to be Mechadesh, that if Mashiach comes between the two Psochim, you do need Bikur Korban Pesach. The only time you don't need Bikr Korb in Pesach Sheni is if you have the Avodo in Pesach Rishon and Chodesh Nisan. Then you have a Miyot not in Iyer. But if Mashiach was not around and the Pesach Mikdash was not built on Pesach Rishon, then, according to the Yerushalmi that the Pesach Rishon brings, you would need Bikr Pesach Sheni. And Eilo, the Chassam Soifer, when he writes the Tshuva in Yud Iyer, 
יום ביקור פסח שני, כוס הכהן תודה ירושלמי.